You have agreed to become my pet. <laughs> Which means woof or yes are all you say. Things like no don't come out of my dogs. Uh, you're kidding, right? What the fuck? What? Some Hello and welcome back to another episode of Let's React. I'm Kenny and this is Montana. And today we're going to be reacting to episode two of Chainsaw Man, Arrival in Tokyo. Last episode, we saw the birth of the Chainsaw Man with... Uh, Denji basically getting stabbed a billion times by zombies and then he gets sort of absorbed and transformed with Pochita, his little dog, and gains the power to pull a ripcord and become the Chainsaw Man and become very powerful. He has been found by somebody who's called him her pet, which is a step up from being treated terribly like he was, but still not exactly where you want to be. But uh, what is are your it, thoughts? Is it, Kenny? Well... <laughs> Anyway, what are your thoughts before we jump into this episode? I've heard the show is like a different kind of gore. And like, we <laughs> definitely saw that. But I mean, obviously not the extent of it because it was one episode. Yeah, but not necessarily. So it's um, gore, but it's also gross stuff more than gore. Yeah. Like, I know there's some vomit stuff, I'm pretty sure. Awesome. The distinction between gore and gross stuff is not something that I really ever thought about until yeah. this moment. Well, we're gonna find out. If you are excited for more Chainsaw Man, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below, and check out the Patreon link in the description below to see these episodes of Chainsaw Man and My Hero Academia now in their extended uncut forms. All right, I think that's about it. Are we excited for episode two of Chainsaw Man? Absolutely. All right, let's get it. Let's go. Underheads, this video was brought to you by the incredible members of the Let's React Patreon. If you want access to a ton of exclusive perks, check out the link in the description below. Have a good day, Twinkle Toes. Got a car. CGI. Great. That's an eyeball. Great. <clears throat> Sorry, that was my stomach. It's fine. What's your name? Uh, it's Denji, ma'am. Make a mental note, Denji. You have agreed to become my pet, so you're officially under my care now. <laughs> Which means woof or yes are all you say. It's like no, don't come out of my dogs. Uh, you're kidding, right? What the fuck? What? I have an acquaintance in forensics. They told me unhelpful pups get put down. Uh, oh my <laughs> god, what? Here I was thinking. Well, okay, what? okay, okay, <laughs> what? <laughs> And you're over here like, um... No, okay. <laughs> Kuvira vibe. Did... <laughs> there it is. <laughs> is this like... I'm... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> She's so flustered. <laughs> we are... What? 48 I'm... seconds in. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? <laughs> like... Wolf or yes are all you get to say. All right, let's keep watching. Oh my God. I was thinking she was sweet. Hell, I even liked her a little. Who knew she'd turn out to be so scary? Treating me like a damn dog of all things. Oh no! Oh. I just remembered that Pochita's dead. Oh. I wonder if we ever get to see Pochita again. None of us have eaten breakfast either. We'll grab a quick bite at the rest stop up ahead. Get whatever you're hungry for. And don't sweat the cost. It's my treat. Really? Wear this so your shirtless self doesn't stand out. Huh? Take it. I mean, she's like weirdly nice and not nice at the same time. People always call me dirty and smelly and straight up avoid me. Nobody ever acts this nice. Especially when they look half as good as her. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> okay. Oh. Great opening. Can't wait to meet this cast of characters. Yeah, right? It's always fun when you don't know everybody in the intro yet. Mm hmm You just got to imagine what they could be like. Well, and then it's always cool when you, like, know what their intro vibes are, and then you meet them for the first time. Yeah. I'll take some udon and sausage on a stick. Is that cool? Very cool. Curry udon for me, if you please. Coming right up. Man, that don't sound bad either. You know. Hello there. Are you okay? Can you stand up? What's the grand total? Uh, Denji? 
I'm sorry. Those creeps weren't the only ones my chainsaws tore through. I guess I'm almost as low on blood as I am on dough. Just how did your body oh. evolve into a human weapon? It blood. It takes his blood too. A little guy replaced Interesting. My heart. Unbelievable, right? Oof. I honestly don't want to believe it. Poor you have given up his life so I could keep mine. Oh, it's so sad. It's sad. Historically speaking, a devil taking the place of a human's vital organ has very few precedents. So few, in fact, it doesn't even have a name. Though it's rare, I believe you. See, I have a nose that detects certain things most can't, and it knows you aren't lying. That's a <laughs> good tool. Still alive inside Very you, handy. Both in a figurative and literal sense. Oh, your body emitting two That's cool. Spells, one human, one devil. Yeah. <clears throat> awesome. That's such a huge relief. Ooh, must take some getting used to. Yeah, I'm sure. Where's the Udon? Huh? Huh? Where? Uh. That looks really good. Can I please dig in? Sure. I have to ask, though. <laughs> Think you're really up to it? Of course I... Up to... I'm gonna need help. Here. Say, uh... Uh... <laughs> um... What? <laughs> like it? to see someone enjoy soggy udon this much no You're way boy, aren't you? <gasps> no different than a trained dog what the fuck is oh happening oh my god I, uh, didn't catch your name <laughs> makima Ms. makima do, do you have a type like in guys <laughs> well <laughs> he's like please say it's me dogs please say dogs <laughs> dingy type guys <laughs> Denji type? Oh. Dude, that's me? <laughs> this guy. <laughs> what are you thinking? Do, do you have a type? What is oh, happening? Yeah. You know, uh, I'm into you too, Miss Makima. Uh, Come on, Denji. I'm like We're stunned. What the f- Okay. <laughs> this building's the Tokyo HQ for our devil hunters. Including civilians, there are over a thousand devil hunters defending the city. But public safety <laughs> operatives have the best benefits package by far. All the pay time off is pretty amazing. Those are some big shoes. He's got big, big shoes, shoes to fill. <laughs> Safe to say Miss Makima has a thing for me. If the two of us work Oh, together, you think? Will we eventually get together? And then if we get together, we can do that stuff together. <laughs> I want it! I want to do that stuff so bad! <laughs> this voice acting! You listening? Yeah. Oh my god. He's on. We typically <sighs> work in uniform. Once you're dressed, I'll introduce you to a colleague. This is another this dog? This gentleman here is Aki Hayakawa. He's your senior by three years. You're going to shadow him for the day, Denji. Uh, I thought you and me would be working together as a team. Well, you figured wrong. She's still out of your league. You don't even play the same sport. Let's go oh, my God. Okay, who is this? You're going to think it's Matt Mercer, Shut aren't up. you? Shut You're up. You're going to think it's <laughs> Matt Mercer, aren't you? Actually, I can't look this up. So true. Well. Really? Get up. <laughs> You need to get up off the floor. All right, let's see here the line again. Let's see if we can. Wrong. She's still out of your league. You don't even play the same sport. Let's go patrol. Wait, please, Miss <laughs> You need to call it. Get up. No way. <laughs> yeah, that's to you. Perform well, and we'll work together down the road. The road's length depends on you. That's kind of ominous. It isn't it. Because that means the road could end. So true. So and it's based and on your decisions. Best. So. She's so okay. convincing. I'm very confused about what the fuck Single. is happening. <laughs> she, he's shadowing him. N n okay, that is so not what I meant at all. I meant the entire vibe. Of, it's just of the vibe. Of, okay. <laughs> what is Our, going on? What the fuck is happening? Hey, 
Big man. Is Miss Makima like single or? <laughs> he has one thought on his mind. Do you know? <laughs> hey. Come with me. Oh my goodness. Oh damn. Not smoking a cigarette over what? it. Yeah, you really should quit. <laughs> Show up tomorrow and I'll kick your ass again. What's your problem? Just that my kindness seems a bit wasted on you. People who don't knuckle down and wise up to this job die. Every associate I've met that got into devil hunting for the paycheck is pushing up daisies now. And that's not an exaggeration. I just realized what pushing up daisies means. That's hilarious. You didn't know that already. I didn't know that. That's a really uh, interesting moment. That you. is... Wow. All right. The only ones who survive are those with strong convictions at their core. Makima is the sole reason you're here. Am I right? Bingo. Hmm. <laughs> Then I'm glad I beat the crap out of you. Oh. I'll do you a favor and tell her you ran away. Terrified by the devils that would have ended you. Gross. Oh! Oh! That looked painful. You full of it when you said you wasted kindness on me. But you are nice, cause I fight it, dude. It's nuts or nothing. Oh my God, nuts or nothing. I had some udon for the first time ever today. I also ate a sausage. Another first for me was being treated like a freaking human being. So what if I didn't think it yeah, through when he's I gonna agreed to this? Cling cake? to it. I would die to keep this life. Understand That's me. interesting to think about. They showed how low his life was before him. I'm not okay with dying. I mean, it's not just my life that's a anymore. pretty accurate representation of that. Yeah. Ugh. Yeah. I'm surprised he's you standing after dreaming. all those kicks. See, a woman like Makima is way too good for a thug like you. What the hell? Bet you're just saying that because you want it for yourself, huh? No, no! Oh my what god. What the fuck is happening? If you're coughing up blood from you nut shots, okay. you're in a bad spot. Just went for the balls. <laughs> that's Nothing it. Else. Like that's balls. Like that's not really a fair fight to be honest, because you're just gonna lose. I just a testicle devil appeared and went ape shit on his nutsack, <laughs> ma'am. <laughs> he made that entire thing up. <laughs> a testicle oh, devil. So I don't know if I can say that on this channel. You already seem so close. You think you two can work with each other? Not a chance! I'd sooner work with a trash can. Seems like you're on the same wavelength. I think assigning Denji to your squad is the right choice. Squad? Well, no. This punk in my Nightmare. unit? Nightmare. I've got enough troublemakers as it is. Adding another weirdo to the mix would... I don't know. Remember when I put your team together? I said that you'd be operating differently as a sort of experiment. <sighs> Please, ma'am. What's the deal with this guy? <laughs> here is a human. However, he can also turn into a devil. Damn straight. Pretty sick, huh? Are you being completely serious? A devil shifter. This case is special. Thus, Denji is going to be receiving special treatment. Oh, she's us. kind of terrifying. Should yeah, he attempt to resign scary. or ever disobey orders, he'll be disposed of as a devil on the spot. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Whoa. Wait well, that's horrible. What does that mean? If he tries to quit he's gonna be killed but he also said yikes he said he would die to keep that life oh so i mean they're I kind of on the same page destruction yeah. in that regard but mm, i think it's because she could technically claim he's the devil if he tries to leave 100 percent. but like she didn't know he felt that way when she said that so like it's not as terrible for him because that's kind of in line with, with what he wanted but it's still pretty It's terrible. still horrifying. Yeah. You'll be living with me now. Makes watching you easier. FYI, I've been instructed to kill you should you run. I mean, they were right there. Okay. Hey, you think Miss Makima is bad? If you're that unsure, then you should just Is she up. bad? <laughs> you are a devil. Be grateful that you're alive. 
Hunting your kind is what we do. Then Miss Markham was good. That should go without saying. How could she be anything less when she saved my life? Like, I'm still torn on whether yeah, she's good she's or bad. I'm very, very confused. Oh, again someday. <laughs> strawberry jam, plum jam, orange marmalade. It's got uh, all over the place. Nice touch too, but Same I spoon? It up with cinnamon. Change the spoon. I have created the ultimate toast. Oh. Um, mm. Whoa! It's that friggin' tactic! Well, it makes sense. He wouldn't know how to use this kind of stuff. Oh my goodness! Finish it up in there. <laughs> we needed this scene. What is happening? Okay. <laughs> what? All the toilet paper. A scene's been reported in an East Nettima residence. All civilians have evacuated, and the area is fully cordoned off. So the fiend in question is holed up in a second story room. We'll let you devil hunters take it from here. Got a rookie tagging along, Hayakawa? So, what's this fiend thing? <sighs> Please, they cover fiends in school. Well, I didn't go to school. Fiend. Devils who take control of corpses. Mm. Oh. Fiends. Okay. Okay. Wait, that would make me one. No, their heads have very distinctive features. You'll see what I mean soon enough. Oh god, it's gonna be possession. It's gonna look really gross. Oh. 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 Fiends have the devil's personality. And you're gonna kill this one. Turn devil and show me what you can do. That'll help me determine how useful you are. I wonder how much control he has. Yeah. Oh. So he's not... He's not going devil, yeah. He's not going to transform, hey. but he will kill it. Why didn't you transform into a devil? When I kill things with my powers, it's messed up. Like, super cruel. I mean, it kind of is. <laughs> yikes. How stupidly close was I to end up like Beetleface over here? And bottom line is, I wanted to make it painless if I could. You know the real bottom line? Fiends are bona fide devils. No place for sympathy if you're hunting them. I witnessed a devil kill my whole family. I've had uh, drinks with those cops outside. Minimizing They're cruelty is not sympathy. To protect the people they hold most dear. Everyone's serious about this, but you. I want any devil I slaughter to suffer as much as possible. Hmm. Then there's you, the sap who wants to be buddies with them. I'll gladly be a devil's friend if they ever made the offer. Because I don't have any friends. Oh. Interesting. I'll yeah, anything that. is better than nothing. Ooh, he'll remember that. Mm -hmm. It's like one of those video games where you make a decision and it'll go. This, this has consequences. Yeah, exactly. I'm surprised you know that. I have. There's a TikTok trend. <laughs> Smile and look to the right. There it is. Yes, I pissed him off. Truth is, I was just trying to keep blood off the merchandise. <laughs> Story real fast when the chainsaws are revved and rearing. I made it quick and easy. So these are my reward. Mm. Mm. All right, the porn is secured. <laughs> oh my <laughs> God! That's all I ask of you. Is that his no, dream? I'm serious, right? Bochita, I'm living the dream. My end of the bargain is being fulfilled. I'll remember that. Believe me. Bet we don't see eye to eye because he's still chasing his dream. Well, I already nabbed mine and then some. Interesting to start a show I like take that. Daily baths, yeah. Eat awesome food, hang around a sexy chick who doesn't mind me. My life's a 10 out of 10. So something's like gotta something's happen. Missing. Yeah. Is something missing? Did I space on my true goal? His goal's gotta be some revenge shit. And they're trying to protect their families. Us right now? It's analyzing. Is running for a finish line too? Makima. <laughs> really? Want to touch her boobs? <laughs> He's got one goal in mind. Single track mind. Yeah, seriously. I've got a big boy job now, so maybe I could pull it off. I doubt I could go all the way with a girl. But second base. Where there's a will, there's a way, and there's definitely a will. 
everyone serious <laughs> about this but you. That's his main I convention. Mean, what do you conviction. Mean now? I found one or two things I'm serious about. The goal to give my life purpose is melons. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. His hero's His journey life purpose begins with boobs. <laughs> you know what? It's different than any other anime. Some exciting news. Starting today, you'll have a partner. Who, me? Yes, you. As a precaution, public safety executes patrols, small-scale missions, and whatnot. This might be the last character from the intro. Okay. Ah, oh, perfect timing. She's here. Hmm? Do watch your back, though. She's a bit on the fiendish side. Oh, is she a oh, is she actual actual fiend? Scum, including so-called partners. You stand in the presence of power. That's your name? Those horns. Wait, hold up. A fiend devil hunter's got to be breaking some kind of rule. Good God. I guess it's fine. Great to meet you. Fiends are just as much targets for elimination as devils. But since power is highly <laughs> rational, I appointed her to Hayakawa squad. Public Interesting. Devil Extermination Special Division 4 is experimental after all. Because of that, the higher-ups will be looking to swiftly dissolve your team if you can't get results. You're both aware of what's in store for you should that prove to be the case, yes? They both die. <laughs> yeah. So they both have a lot on the line. Will attract mm -hmm. unwanted attention. So the fewer pedestrians in the area... She should get a fancy control, hat. The better. Yeah, is there no way to hide them? <laughs> Problem solving. Wonder what her devil powers are. Smacking the shit out of people. Pray for me, post haste. I yearn for the savor of blood. So this is they're Absolutely like inverses not. of each other. Because oh, this right. is a devil piloting a human versus a human piloting, piloting a, a devil. devil. Yeah. Ah. Because this is like a devil's personality. Mm-hmm. Kitty cat. Absolutely not. Kitty cat. I can put up with crazy as long as the crazy. I thought he was gonna enough. try to eat the cat. Okay. She, she was looking. Hands on those boobs, though. Good God, man. If you run into any civilian devil hunters, or the police question you about you what your intentions are, you we're public safety devil hunters, sirs. They might give you a sour expression, but they should leave you alone after that. Gotta be odd for him to have power after this much time of being just away? stepped on. Yeah. The name likely lies with me. Before I took up the life of a fiend, I was a formidable devil feared by all. You for real? How do we hunt devils with no devils to hunt? Should you have questions about this change, just ask Hayakawa. He's the one who paired you two together. That great eight. Oh, he's probably just trying to like purpose. waste his time. Stuck me with this devil repellent, so I can't do anything cool. Smart. Mm. Attempt to get me fired. <laughs> Quite the choice of animation yeah. on the face there. I smell blood. <laughs> All right, we're What's off. What's the rush, crazy? Time to fight! Time to fight! Time to take you out! Chaos is back. Yes, that's correct, sir. The scene's evacuated and blocked as of now. It's the sea cucumber devil. Requesting a sea cucumber back. devil. Not the sea cucumber devil. Interesting. Whoa. Oh Ooh. God. Whoa. It's not really her body, I guess. You know. Oh my God. Holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> Mortals behold! The glory of the kill is mine! <laughs> oh my god. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, that's the end of Chainsaw Man episode two. I feel like I just had a fever dream that whole time. Yeah. Well, something interesting about this show, it has a different outro song every single episode. Okay. There might be a different outro animation, but I think it might be a different outro animation and song. But anyway, uh, that was Chainsaw Man Episode 2. Your puny body contains such strength. Why would you waste it playing protector? I don't give a shit about this guy. <laughs> Not blind. <laughs> He's through the car back. <laughs> Oh my god. What are your first thoughts? So Mach maybe that's just like her thing with everyone who works for her? Yeah, I wonder if she, Makima views all of them as pets or just him. Like, why is... She didn't really do any of that other terminology to the other one. No. Yeah. It's gonna be interesting to see where this show goes. It feels yeah. very random and I don't know quite where it's going right now, but that's about it for episode two of Chainsaw Man. 
Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below if you enjoyed that episode or excited for more episodes coming every Thursday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you can't wait and want to see these episodes along with these episodes of My Hero Academia and Demon Slayer, check out the Patreon link in the description below where they're all posted in their extended uncut forms. We have a lot to discuss before we do that. Where are we headed? All right, let's review. Thank you for watching. For now, we're going to go to questions given to us by our amazing Patreon members. If you want to ask us questions after every episode we watch of any series, make sure to join the link in the description below and start asking. For now, let's go to question one. All right, uh, question one. Miss Breadloaf asks, Denji has been partnered with Power. With Power, it's funny that she's just named Power. Yeah. <laughs> Did she choose what that? What do we name this character? Yeah. Power. Um, I wasn't pa even thinking of it from that perspective. It was like, what did they pick their name to be? Or what did their parents name them? Mm. I wonder if a demon has parents. Interesting. Denji has been partnered with Power. With Power being self-motivated and childish, and Denji believing he was set up with a key to not have any fun himself, do you think their dynamic will improve to where they can be better partners with each other? Because they're kind of inverses of each other, too, in terms of their devil dynamic. Okay, I think they're like their differences are primarily going to cause issues, but after a while, I think they're going to be able to learn from the like human versus devil aspect of the other one and be able to like incorporate it into their own gotcha stuff and like i'm having a hard time describing exactly what i mean but it's like a like maybe they can understand like their weaknesses and maybe the other one has a strength that exactly correlates yeah yeah and through maybe like that parallel growth and understanding they start working together better because they like appreciate the other one's input even if they aren't all that similar yeah i could definitely see that it's it's going to be interesting to see more of power as a character because she just seems like a bloodthirsty menace at this point. Yeah. And I wonder like... Absolute wrecking ball. Yeah. And also the fact that demons avoid... <laughs> I, I found it funny that they're like, the sea urchin demon. Like, what was that? That was not a do? sea urchin. It was a sea cucumber. <laughs> he looks so upset that I got that wrong. They look so different. Okay. Well, the sea cucumber devil, <laughs> what was it going to do? But that entrance was pretty crazy, making like a blood hammer out of thin air. That was... Yeah. That was... Gross. Gross. <laughs> yeah, that's probably most of the show. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, going to be interesting to see their dynamic moving forward. Let's go to our second question. Graham asks, a lot of fans have said that Denji's character arc is pretty much a ascent up Maslow's hierarchy of needs. Are you familiar with that psychological concept? If so, how far do you think Denji is mapping to it so far? He also goes on to say, having read a lot of Fujimoto's work, I think he tends to go for these more grounded motivations, personal fulfillment, safety and security, intimacy and love, and for even some of his most grandiose characters and villains. It's something that's always stuck out to me as work compared to other anime where characters have more high-minded <clears throat> or abstracted goals. Like, it, that is true. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, they, usually they're like, I'm going to save the world. Okay, so... Maslow's hierarchy of needs. Very, very interesting. And this is obviously a vast oversimplification. But basically at the bottom, it's the things that like you cannot survive without, like oxygen, food, water, shelter. And then the next level above that is like things that you really need to live but not survive, like mm -hmm. a, a job, um, like family, health. Um, and then as it goes up the pyramid, there are things that are like progressively less necessary to survival, but more important to like your mental development as a person. Uh. One of the major takeaways is that you can't build anything above the like lowest met level. So for instance, something on the very top level is creativity. So, like if you're not able to be creative, you're not going to be having every single one of your needs as a human met. With that being said, if someone doesn't have food, meeting their creative needs does fuck all for their situation. Yeah. So you have to build from the ground up, kind of. Gotcha. So in the context of Denji, because he has existed for so long with very few of his very bottom of the pyramid needs met, he has not been able to begin to expand to the other levels. He has no development of anything no. he could want. He's been living in this... It, fight or flight, yeah. survival, like there's just no consideration for anything else. 
I'm curious to see what or how they would demonstrate the like progression of those levels because if it you would, would start to realize them. Yeah, and I feel like it would it would probably be I don't think that would be like a fast transition. Like that is such like a deeply ingrained thing that I I don't I don't even know how long that would take to get over. I can't even imagine that. I guess my thinking could be maybe the fact that he got reborn with the devil. Maybe like maybe that jump start can like kind of just allow him to maybe even like a scat like I feel like this goal feels pulled out of a rabbit hat right now where it's like he was just kind of scram he's kind of in a new world scrambling trying to figure out anything about anything mm -hmm. and just the first thing that caught his mind he sort of was like all right this is my motivation now you know yeah. like because he lit I think that one shot where he's like these people want to protect their families this guy's got revenge like I feel like that was very much calling out the full battles the death note like, yeah of the world where it's always like like, I'm There's a reason the world. for it. Yeah. Yeah. So I think it. I mean, it's it's different. It's different. It is and different. It's going to be interesting to see if they can progress him up that, or if he just stays at this sort of immature goal level. Well, I think that is about it for episode two of Chainsaw Man. Thank you for watching. Are we excited for whatever's going to come next? We don't know. If, I mean, Code Geass jumped from about thirty-three thousand views to fifty which is unprecedented. So it does seem like Code Geass is probably going to be our second show along with My Hero Academia because My Hero Academia also has grown to a similar level and uh, it's just pretty exciting. So we're excited for what's going to come next. We'll keep you all posted. But for now, um, that was episode two of Chainsaw Man. Uh, are we excited for what's coming next? Can't wait. All right, let's get it. Let's go.